is growing, and with that growth comes a concern about sustainability. The community often asks the question, where will we get our water? Will we have enough water? Well, today I'm with the water department here in the city of Peoria, asking those questions and finding out more about their plan. Well, we're here in North Peoria where much of the growth is happening. Jenna Norris is with me. Business, residential, I mean, it is booming and everyone's excited about that, but with the growth comes a concern for water. Where are we gonna get our water? Will we have enough water? What is the city doing to ensure that? Planning for Peoria's water future is the utmost priority for the water services department here. And one of the biggest attestments to that commitment is through the designation of assured water supply. So this is a regulatory program that Peoria participates in that ensures that we have renewable supplies that are available, accessible, reliable for at least 100 years, and that we also are planning for growth in these time horizons. So the growth that you're seeing in this area and the growth that you'll continue to likely see in Northern Peoria is certainly planned and accounted for by the Water Services Department. With that, with the water that we do have, how do you guys manage the supply? What are some of the other things you do besides planning? Because I'm, I'm getting planning is a big part of that and really looking ahead before you say yes to new things coming into the city. So Peoria really takes an all of the above approach. We have many, many different projects going on that are identified exactly through these planning documents of what we need to invest in infrastructure-wise, supply-wise, to make sure that we're keeping up with these demands. One great example of that is residents have likely seen um, signs in northern Peoria and maybe some large purple pipes along the side of the road. Um, that's from expanding our reclaimed infrastructure. So right now we are expanding that reclaimed infrastructure to move um, reclaimed water that will eventually be able to meet the landscaping demands of a few city parks, one of them being Paloma. Okay, the word drought comes up, especially in uh, the state we live in. How do you, as the water department, plan for the future with the likelihood that a drought could happen? Drought is certainly something that impacts our supplies. We're reliant on two supplies that are rivers, and so they are fed by snowmelt. And so these years where you see less snowpack, we plan for that in our infrastructure investments and the ways that we're moving water in the city to make sure that we are prepared for shortage. We appreciate all the time behind the scenes. I think that's what residents probably need to know. There's so much behind the scenes work that goes into getting to a point like this, what we see behind us. We're making sure that we're looking far out into the future so that nothing is catching us off guard. All right, Jenna, thank you so much. Thank you. As always, thanks for watching and be on the lookout for more episodes as we focus on the issues that matter to you.